Hi there, Michael Parry from Frank Modern Estate Agents. Today I'm stood outside Peterborough train station, which provides easy access to King's Cross in under 50 minutes. The property I'm about to show you today is located 0.7 of a mile from here. Let's take a look. If you're approaching by vehicle, you would take this turning, which is St. John's Close, which takes you onto the estate. So I'm currently stood at the pedestrian entrance to the estate. The estate is private, which means the roads are private, the green space surrounding me is private, and there is use also of a children's playground, which is private. The whole estate is situated around the Gables, which is a Grade 2 listed building situated behind me. In 2017, this was converted into luxury apartments. The total amount of properties on this estate, there are 63 properties that were developed by Western Homes. Most of them were new build. And the property we're about to see is located in the corner behind me. The property offers over 2,000 square foot accommodation on three levels. Welcome to Two Memorial Way. As you can see, it's nearly Christmas. Uh, this particular property is unexpectedly back on the market. One of the things that really struck me about this property when we first came here was the position it occupies. It's tucked away in the corner and it overlooks green space. And for me, if you have any property in a city location or an urban location that has an open green space to the front of it, it always makes it slightly more desirable uh, than perhaps other properties on the estate that might look into people's lounges or kitchens at the very front. The other part of this property that's fantastic is the open plan layout at the back and the owners have extended the property in the last couple of years to create an amazing open space. Let's go and have a look. So we're in the kitchen area. This is a great part of the house. Western Homes did a fabulous job uh, when they installed these kitchens. Uh, they're all fully integrated. Um, you have quartz worktops on the island and on the sides here, uh, breakfast bar area, you've got induction hob with extractor above, fridge, freezer, microwave, double oven, grill, wine cooler, instant hot water tap, dishwasher. Now if you imagine where I'm stood now, this was the edge of the house when the house was built. So this was the entire kitchen. All of this area has been added on in the last couple of years to create, I think, an amazing space. Another alteration is this was the, where the lounge ended. What our clients have done is they've just moved the wall forward slightly. This is a partition wall can be uh, removed or a doorway could be put in if needed. This is gonna be a bar area. In this part of the space, you've got two substantial lanterns which flood the room with natural light. This is a fully insulated room, all done to building regs. You've got two radiators in here and fully retractable bifolding doors which overlook the garden space. Stepping out of this rather impressive extension, the garden is separated into two distinctive areas. We have the timber decked area here, which is ideal for summer entertaining. Uh, you've got areas where you can install your garden furniture very easily. We also have a bit of a bonus area here, which again could be utilized. You may put a pergola here or even a garden shed if you, if you wished. The other section of the garden is the flagged patio area here, which has some raised borders and access to the detached double garage, which has loft storage, power, and an electric up and over door at the front. There is also another bonus area here as well, which again, like the area over there, could be utilized in a different way. One of the things that really surprises me is how quiet it is. We're 0.7 of a mile from Peterborough train station and you could hear a pin drop. 
In addition to the rear open plan space, there is also a separate utility room, WC, and to the front of the property, there are two reception rooms. One is slightly bigger than the other. They can both be used as sitting rooms or lounges independently. They both have a very pleasant front outlook overlooking the gables and the communal gardens of the gables. So we're currently on the first floor of the property. This floor consists of four double bedrooms, two of which are ensuite, have ensuite showers, all with Fashino electronically controlled showers and taps. There is also a family bathroom, which has a bath and separate shower, again with electronically controlled taps. The two front bedrooms overlook the communal gardens of the gables. Okay, so we're on the second floor of this property now, and the entire floor consists of the principal bedroom and principal bathroom suite. In the bathroom, a bit of an echo, there's quite high ceilings in here. Um, it's dominated by the Fashino uh, electronic controls for the shower and both hand wash basins. You can control the flow and you can control the temperatures digitally, which is very smart. Uh, you've got you know, the double hand wash basins here. If you see the, the Fashino taps, very, very smart bit of kit there. Two uh, roof lights providing more natural light. There's a freestanding bath, which has a uh, mixer tap and shower attachment, ladder towel radiator, Additional storage here, great for cloak storage. Principal bedroom, you've got two double wardrobes, equally sized, there's no arguments. A side window, allowing more natural light. You've got two double radiators. And then you've got French doors, which provide access, have a look, to the balcony. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any further inquiries or would like a personalised viewing appointment, please do not hesitate to get in touch with us on 01733 979 033 or email us at hello at frankmodern.co.uk. Thank you.